and welcome back to another video. Uh, today uh, we're going to be discussing about tier 3 and 4 tier list. Let's be quick about it now. There are 64 items here. If you're going to match C, this thing's got good front armor but not good mobility. And Sherman C, bad reverse speed, bad armor. Shabelle class 3 and 4. These two are all, uh, almost identical but the tree is slightly better. Shinu C, T35 C. TV1 is B because of its good armor and it's actually quite fast too. Saw 42 D. This thing is supposed to be tier 2, honestly. M109 D. It has engine as armor, but it's too big. Shed. This is a, uh, a C. The armor is not good, but it's got quite a lot of crew and surprisingly hard to kill since it's space. Yeah, I'm gonna actually make it a B. 35 also B. EMX CDC C. M18 S. This thing is incredibly quick, even if it's a loud engine and bad reverse. Still incredibly quick. Project T17 B. The armor is ah uh, meh, but mobility is good, I guess. ELC A. This thing is a rat tank of tier 3 4. It's short and fast. MV107 B. It's fast, yes, but it's an IFV and armor is not good. But you can still do well with it. Pumi. B2. This thing has bad traction, but. And. It still looks. It, it's still good, though. You can use it. C. For the 2S1. This is the same case with the M109, but it's less wide and a bit longer. T35 turret. Actually, wait. Let's do the hulls first. What is this here? Type 63. Let's see. I haven't actually had any experiences with this, so I don't know. T34. A. This thing is surprisingly durable if you angle it and wiggle with it. And AM XM 800T. It's an A. It's like a slightly worse M18. And then after that, we, do we have any more hulls down here? Yeah, we do. Down there. So the blueprint hulls. KTAW 2021. No experience. Centaur, no experience. Fast Panzer. This is a BB. Uh, no, C actually plays music and it's quite loud. Not good. Speedster. Speedster, sorry. No experience. Uh, Storm Tiger or Battle Packs. Uh, this is honestly an S. If you angle with this and they don't know how to kill it, which is the gunner side or gunner port, that's. It's pretty much invincible. Right, moving on to the turrets. Fumi 2342. This is a C. 35. It's very big and no armor T. And it's slow. FE 107. A. This thing's got an incredibly fast turn and good elevation and depression angles. Consider AA. D. No armor. Shinu. C. It's a mediocre turret. T3045. This is a B. Because it, it can be a bit trolly sometimes for some reason. It has three crew members inside of it too. M4A2, no experience. KV2. This is a C, even though it has quite high reload multiplier, you can still get ammo rack really easily. BMP1. B. It's quite low profile. That's one of the upsides, though it has no armor. And the uh, ammo racks is posted so bad. Honestly, this is an LC, not a B. 2S1, C. Metal Pass 4G, C. These are all just mediocre turrets with no very good upsides. And Metal Pass 3, also C. XM800T, B. It's slightly worse, FE107, it's slightly slower. M18 turret, B. Same with, same with the XM. Sherman, it's another C. Just another mediocre turret. And then Project T17. C Tiger turret. It's got incredibly good armor for it, but it's a bit slow. Honestly, it's still it's still a B. And then after that, Battle Pass 4-2. This is better than the Tiger turret since it moves faster and armor is comparable. A. M109. It's got a computing ability, even though it's really quite big. You can still really do good at it and if you're sniping. 
Cavalry 2021. I don't not experience on it. Centaur, no experience, Bass Panzer. C because it also plays music and it's quite loud. Now we're moving on to the guns. Heat launcher 105. Uh B, it's penetration's quite good, damage is mediocre. Empire 75. Next is 50mm KWK39. This is an A. Due to its fast reload and quite good penetration. The UE57, no experience. Sherman 75, no experience. 20mm SDK FCG. It's an also it's a B, it's a B yeah. It's it overheats quite quickly, that's the problem of it. The KWK2, 15mm, it's just a very good 39, which is right, it's really OP when paired with the battle pack since no one can penetrate you. Econi 75 S. 105 Dev 152 Devastator. A. It can overpressure quite a lot of things, but the reloads is the only thing preventing it to be an S. Scimitar 57 B. 20mm M139 C. 150 Howitzer. It's just the worst Devastator. That's it. 50mm Flak. 40mm Flak. Sorry. It's an A2. Since it's quite good at penetrating things. Crusader 57, no experience. ASU 57, the gun, not the hull. B. And let's scroll down a bit here. The last two guns, the Freedom, it's an S. No questions asked. 75 mm 8043, no experience at all. Alright, that's the final tier list. I'm gonna scroll from the up from top to bottom to let you see which ones are the good ones and the bad ones and the mediocre ones. Please tell me if you disagree with my rating in the comments. And sorry if you, uh, this video seems rushed. There's quite a lot of a lot of things here, and I really want to make it faster than the previous video, which is I think nine minutes long. All right. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video, which is about tier five and six. Kev is out.